Hey guys, this is Allison from Melly Cat Creations. How are you? Please like, share, and subscribe to my channel if you haven't done so already. And if you'd like to help me out, all the links will be in the drop box below. I'm gonna give you guys a little bit of an update about my situation. Um, things are progressing really well. Crazy. It took forever for me to get out of New York. Forever. Ever, ever, ever. I got a nice shiny binder. Home inspection. Um, earlier today, I went over the report with my realtor and there was a few issues. The house is old. It's from 1959. So they have to kind of come back and do some work before I move in that the owners have to pay for. And it's not much, but you have to compromise a little bit with me. Mm -hmm. So now I'm just waiting on them and what they're gonna do, if they're gonna do it. Then I get a closing date. So I'm really excited. I'm here at the hotel still. I really like it here, so it's okay. Um, kitties are not happy going into the mansion still. Ethan was traumatized earlier. Um, I went looking for snow plows. Um, there's a snowstorm way up north, but um, I've been told by the locals to really get on it when it comes to certain snow supplies. Um, and even though I don't have a house just yet, uh, I have a storage unit. So I could secure myself a plow and then store it so that I have it because I need it. So yeah, I'm really excited. And um, my mom and my dad, but my two moms particularly are adamantly telling me I need to thank everybody, which I am always very grateful and thankful for everybody who has helped me out in the last year because they couldn't be here to do that physically. They can manipulate energy and bring people into my life as much as they would like to um, from upstairs, but they're not here physically. So I really wanna take this moment to thank everybody who has really come in and saved my life, literally. This has been a very trying year I don't even know how I'm going to fathom all because it's just been a whirlwind of hell. And now this is not hell. This is just limbo. This is just an in-between. And as uncomfortable as it is, I'm very blessed, to say the least. And then I could start being an angel for other people, which I already have been an angel for one person in particular. They need it. You know, when someone helps you, you help them back when they need it. It's just the way shit goes. That's it. Sorry. I don't determine these things. It does. So I'm hoping today, um, I don't think I'm ping-ponging on my phone as much. In the last hour, I was on the phone a lot. Going over reports, getting email documents, having to sign, go back and forth. Um, I went to my car. And I have your ranch too. I got my luggage. Um, I don't have my Oracle cards out just yet. That'll be coming. That'll be coming. So yeah, I have a house picked out. 
I have the inspection done. I'm really happy with the condition of the house. Everything looks really good. There's just a couple of things that need to be done on their end. Um, I'm going to swap out the appliances. I have to get a washer and dryer. But like for the meantime, we still need to move into stuff working. And then find some people that can help me move my stuff in from the storage facility and then change my address again. Again, I have a PO box as of right now. I don't know if I'm keeping it or not but I have a PO box. Um, yeah, it's been a whirlwind. Every day has been like filled with lots of information, lots of things I have to do. The cats have been really, 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 really messy. Um, yesterday they threw a freaking tantrum and a half in the mansion and made a freaking mess. Water everywhere, cat food, litter everywhere. Pee, thankfully no poo. So I had to go do laundry again because I can't stand that smell. I mean, my cats are really, really, really clean, but they threw and pitched a bit. Because I was out of the, I was out doing that inspection just about all day. That's why I didn't do a video the last, the last day and a half. Um, I've been busy, busy, busy. And, you know, when I do a reading, I don't want to have to stop a hundred thousand times because someone's calling me and, and then I lose my, my concentration. I don't want that. No. So next items are, you know, finding bedroom equipment, Appliances that will fit in the cabinetry because those are original and old, but the countertop is brand new. The sink is brand new. I need a new fridge. I think they might be buying a new stove, so I might not have to buy one. Um, microwave, I think I'm keeping. And the dishwasher has to go. Big time. Um, and then I have a huge pool, stand uh, up ground pool in my backyard which is way huger from the pictures that I seen. Like doing the inspection, the first time I did the house viewing, it was hailing outside, it was pouring rain. So we only, we didn't go into the backyard. We just looked from the window, which is, it have beautiful two trees. And then I have a, a, a creek that runs at the end of my uh, backyard which isn't really filled with anything right now. Um, but it's really beautiful. The neighborhood's really nice. I'm off a main road, which would get plowed a hell of a lot more than other roads. No more side street unfortunateness. Used to, you know, say every time I'd have to go to work and look outside to see if the street was plowed to even drive. I'd have to walk. 30 to a half an hour to an hour, depending on how deep the snow is, to get to the freaking bus stop. They plow the roads here. They plow the roads here. I also have to invest in a shed because I don't have a garage. Um, So I need like all my tools and winter shit and brooms and garbage cans and all that fun crap, it needs to be in a shed. I might need two sheds. But the huge, the backyard is ridiculously large. And I didn't even realize that on one side of the house, it like is a big chunk space where I could put a shed where it's not even out in view. Can't wait to make a garden. I just can't wait. I'm really excited. Really, really, really excited. It's just, 
getting over the hump now of transitioning one more time. And I'm gonna get there. It's exhausting, very exhausting. But it's gonna happen. It's gonna happen, I'm excited, I'm happy. I wanted to give you guys this little bit of an update because I said, I owe my words, I'm gonna tell you when I'm going to be able to get my readings done. And I, I finally got the books out of the car. I'm like, I'm going to read today. And then all of a sudden, the last couple of hours is a back and ping pong match between me and my agent in, in the emails. Um, yesterday was the inspection and downloading all the information, the pictures and thermal scans and crazy they didn't even do that at my house. They fucking came in with a freaking drone, went over the roof. And then the guy walked in and out and just checked certain things and bye. Okay, bye. You know. So yeah. Moving along. Now I'm praying that I get a closing date very soon and then I'll be able to know when I'll be moving in or, or if I'm staying here and transitioning slowly into the house. But I'll let you guys, I'll let you guys know once I know for sure. Cause then I won't have internet. I'll just have my phone. Kind of hard to do stuff off the of phone. But we'll figure it out. Anywho, it's just a little mini update on my situation. So house is just about mine. Hopefully I get to close on it soon. Lots of things moving forward really quickly. Yay. And um yeah. Hope. To get some Urantia Awaspe readings done. Awaspe is going to be first done soon. So, sending each and every one of you love and light. I hope all of you have a fantastic day. And I will give you more updates when I hear them. This is all very exciting. It's a lot of work, it's just me. So, I'm sorry that it's been taking me away from my channel and my work. So I want to do my Oracle cards too. I love my readings, but I have a lot of books to read too, <gasps> but all in due time, all in due time. I hope all of you have an amazing rest of your week and if you like to watch Waspay, that's coming up next. See you on that one. Bye, guys.